Shalom, first and foremost, we'll give all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and the Son, Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Yahweh Double honors to the apostles and the elders, GMS, who were well and peace and blessed, hopeful, like GMS, Arkansas, stop and listen. Uh, just looking over this article right here. Uh, from the Reno Gazette Journal, where the governor announced a statewide shutdown of non-essential businesses and casinos. So, you know, them casino junkies, man, they finna, they finna go crazy, man. They can't go hear them lights and those bells and hear the sound of, uh, of, of uh, lustrous winnings in their ears. <laughs> it says, Governor Steve Cecilac, has ordered the statewide shutdown of all casinos and other non-essential businesses in Nevada starting noon Wednesday. The state's latest coronavirus contaminant, contaminant efforts will apply to all bars, gyms, beauty salons, barbershops, malls, and restaurants that do not provide takeout or deli and delivery service. Okay, so you know it's all, hey man, it's direct attack on, on, on us, man. So it says, Cecil C C said in Tuesday's evening press conference that casinos and hotels will be given time to remove their guests before closing for 30 days. Retail malls and stores will also be mothballed for a month and the Silver State adopts drastic measures to combat COVID-19. Gaming machines are to be emptied and shut down by midnight. My ultimate goal here is to come together as Nevadas and save lives. Look at Esau, there you go. Right, there you go lying. Uh, it says, uh, Let me get a description on that when he said that. Um, this is uh, Psalms, the 55th chapter, 21st verse. It says, the words of his mouth were smoother than butter. Okay. He was talking about how he trying to get together basically save lives it says but war was in his heart and this dude this governor he's right along with whatever uh instructions he got from the upper upper elites you know they're closing down all the businesses man so that is they're bringing that that uh warfare to the people man uh, martial law is coming it's addition because they're they're stopping the people cash flow okay People have livelihoods and those things which, that were named, man. People in beauty shops and barber shops. So, you know, that's going to affect a lot of uh, Jake businesses, man. Because Jake's be in beauty shops and barber shops, man. Okay. It says, but war is in his heart. His words were salted in oil, but yet they were drawn swords. Because it all, all this is to come against uh, the nation of Israel, basically. Is to get people used to being what, um, uh, basically, um, put together and get them used to, uh, I don't know what the word, I know the word I want to say, get them used to being, um, uh, in that fear state and get them used to being, damn, I had the word on my tongue, can't even remember Get them used to being locked down. That's what I want to say. So the Wadi Al Bashim Al Shai had them used to being locked down. So the next uh, big thing, maybe this could be the big thing. Even the next one, it'd be easier for them to get the people because they they urging people to stay off the streets, don't go to bars, don't go to these discos or whatnot. They're urging the younger people. So. Hey, the words of his mouth is smoother than butter because he's saying he want to save lives. He told a reporter in Las Vegas that requires aggressive strategies aimed at limiting community spread. 
what's the aggressive strategy to keep you people in your home so you can be quarantined at some time, okay? That you can be tested and quarantined and taking the camps. That's what it's about. And starting, okay? It's going to, it's going to, um, basically, it's going to spread, okay? It says we don't want to waste time. Come, Esau want to do it right away. Why? Because brother, one brother made a good point in a video where they've been moving fast ever since they saw the uh, actual uh, chariot over Earth on the satellite. So they've been moving real fast, okay? Because they... And the reason why is, let's get this. Revelations 12 and 12, therefore rejoice ye heavens and ye that dwell in them. So rejoice heavens, hey, Yahweh Shai, the angels, uh, the ones who have uh, went to sleep that are, that are, the spirits were brought back to the heavens, okay? The elect men rejoice, man, because that time of, of recompense is here, the time of reckoning. These are just certain uh, things that we have to go through in prophecy to deal with these certain things for, for that better day of light and righteousness to, to come, okay? Woe unto the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, for the devil is come down on you having great wrath. And this is not the spiritual demon Satan. It's his counterpart on the, on the earth, which is Esau, okay? The earth is given into the hands of the wicked, right? It says because he knoweth he had but a short time. They know their time is short, so they're going to pull out all stops, man. Okay? They're trying to push this thing to a police state, to a martial law state, and then it's in this chip. This is just part of it, okay? Getting these people with a sheeple gathered together. Okay, getting them used to being locked down. Okay, you know, instead of leading them, being a shepherd and lead them to righteousness, you're gonna lead them to a slaughter. But it's all orchestrated by the power of Yahweh Shem Shai. Okay, he's letting you do that. Okay, uh, let me get that right here, cause he basically letting you do that. Where it says, for the mystery of iniquity doth already work, okay? Only he who now let us let will let until he be taken out of the way, till you be removed, man, out of the way of this rulership. So the Lord letting you do what you're doing until he decides to take you out. Okay, by thermonuclear destruction. Okay. All right. Let me go back. It says, For the devil is come down unto you, Revelation 12 and 12. Having great wrath, man. This martial law. Hey, this closing, closing other streets, you know. And then they have to, they try to make you feel comfortable with telling you, um, well, don't worry about your bills. We can delay those. People want to hear they ain't got to pay them at all. Because if you delay them, or they ain't gonna, you know, they're gonna delay you a month or two, guess what? You still gonna have to pay. You're gonna come out of this, and everybody's gonna be owing $1,000 light bills and gas bills, man. And you're gonna be behind the curve. You know? Rent is still due. Even if they postpone it, you still owe. People wanna hear, hey, they, don't, they ain't gonna owe nothing, even though, you know, this all situations. Through the power of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai, and it's all part of it. But you know, this is part of their uh, uh, being led to the slaughter. But they still want to hear, hey, they ain't got to pay nothing. So that wrath has come down because he knows he got but a short time. Esau, time is up, man. The hourglass is about empty for your rulership. Okay? The city of Jerusalem is getting ready to come out of the heavens, man. All right? Uh, let's see here. It says to the order will not impact essential businesses such as gas stations and grocery stores 
because they know if they cut the grocery store off, it's going to be a real, real March Madness going on. Airports, because see, Esau still got to move. Banks, they still got to move their money. You know, <clears throat> when they get everything set up, they'll shut those down too. The post offices, hospitals, pharmacies, daycares, and urgent care facilities will also remain unaffected. And, and I know, look, they're leaving them daycares up because when you take your kids there, they're going to be, they gonna be uh, putting them vaccinations in your kids in them daycares and be chipping them. So that's what, yeah, of course they're going to leave those open. All right? Of course they're going to leave them open. You know? Let me see here. Uh, let me get two, that's only two, and four. It says, who oppose it and exalted himself above all that is called the most high man. He's adverse to everything of the scriptures. He's doing everything in wickedness. Okay. This is all in wickedness, what he's doing. Okay. It says, or that is worship. So that he, as the Most High, sitteth in the temple, right? He's in the spot. He's in that earth is given into the hands of the wicked. He showeth himself that he is God. Okay, he's showing himself. He's declaring himself. He's demonstrating himself to be as uh, making all these rules for everybody. You know, one 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 man is giving out rules and orders to all for all to abide by. And the end goal is to have everybody chip with all of be under his one authority. Okay? That's what's happening. You know? It says professionals such as doctors, lawyers, accountants, realtors, and others can keep their offices so as long as they observe the health uh, precautions, man. It is unclear if the close, closure order will apply to thousands of workers at Tesla, Spalding Gigafactory, east of Sparks, through uh, Cecilac said, so no employee who wishes to remain home should be required to work. He plans to uh, reevaluate the shutdown order next month. Um... All gatherings should be postponed or canceled. The first term, Democrat added, this is not the time for play dates, sleepovers, concerts, theater, outgoing, and athletic events. So so him taking that away, see, they got the power to take away uh, your, basically like your, your outlet, your entertainment, okay, your entertainment. Cause like people like to go, you know, sit down and watch sporting events just to knock the day off or the week off. But they take your entertainment, meaning the mirth in the tavern cease, the noise of them that rejoice ended, the sound of celebration at these events, man, the cheering you do for your teams and the happiness that you display uh, when you're at these ball games and whatnot, the joy of the harp ceases, man. So that sound of that, a sound of that, uh. Uh, happy, happy times. It's finna, it's finna be ended. I'm gonna skip to verse ten. The city of confusion is broken down. Every house is shut up, that no man may come in. Okay, that's why these different businesses are closed. You know, the different businesses are closed, and you won't be able to go in there and get service, man. Okay, and that's hurting. That's hurting them people who are in those professions. Like I said, I know people go barbers, people working at beauty salons. You know. It's happening, man. So, you know, they, this this is what Esau is doing right now. You know, he's putting a, putting a, putting a foot down because he got a short term. So, you know, hey, the brothers who the business are closing, any Israelites, man, uh, if you in those businesses, man, just you know, especially if it's in the brotherhood, just have faith. Y'all, by Shem, y'all, Shag gonna get us through this thing. Hey, man, we just keep exhorting each other, keep watching out for each other, and uh, we about to get up out of here. So with that call, I love you. How about Shimei? I was shy. 
<clears throat> by Hashem Rekha Kodash, double honors to the apostles and the elders of GMS of real well. Peace and blessings to the hopeful elect. This is GMS Arkansas, GMS Top. Listen to the next time I say Shalom.